Thousands of homeowners across Mecklenburg County could see a huge tax increase under the county's new tax values. Eyewitness News reporter Joe Bruno investigated and he found out which areas are seeing the biggest spikes and the impact on homeowners' wallets. <laughs> The Wesley Heights Colette Forest moved to in 1991 would almost be unrecognizable today. It was a very different neighborhood. Forest's neighborhood and many others on the edge of uptown are changing. Older homes are being bulldozed for new ones. As Forest's surroundings have changed, so has the value of her property. It's a sign of the times. Her home had a value of $133,000 during the last assessment in 2011. This year, it jumped to more than $295,000, a 122.5% increase. That has a big impact on her wallet. Her $1,800 tax bill last year will go up an additional $1,000, not including solid waste fees. They're not just figures on a spreadsheet to me. They're, does my son get EOG tutoring? Does my son go to a summer camp? Wesley Heights is far from the only neighborhood impacted. Figures from the county show some of the areas seeing the largest increases are neighborhoods on the northwest and east sides of Uptown. With the tax rates currently proposed by the city and the county, if the value of your property increased by 36% or more, you will see an increase. It's hostile and it's unfortunate and it's unfair. I found records showing more than 24,000 people across Mecklenburg County have appealed new assessments that would lead to higher tax bills. As a result, the county has already lowered the value of more than 4,000 properties, totaling $192 million in reductions. I would say the county has reduced the you know, Attorney Larry Shaheen helps people through that process. But, I mean, He's helped yeah. hundreds of property owners, leading to millions in reductions. But he cautions against appealing for the sake of appealing. Under no circumstances do you want to make an appeal if you don't think that you have justification for it, because here's the catch your value can go up. If you do appeal, Shaheen advises to go into your meeting with evidence. He also says any talk about the tax rate should be directed at elected officials, not the assessor's office. One does not have anything to do with the other. As for Forrest, she hopes those in charge recognize more needs to be done. I hope that all elected officials have a public servant's heart and they recognize that they work for the people and the people they work for are watching closely. Joe Bruno, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. We can tell you that the deadline to appeal your evaluation is Monday. You'll find more information on our WSOC News app. Joe posted the formula there. That way you can figure out your new property tax bill.